So let's continue through the Whispering Caves. So far we've been fighting off bees, doing a lot of rests, <laughs> saving and restoring from random encounters. But we're getting through this. Oh, I don't have my bus up. There we go. Up now. We'll attack this other drone. And you are gone. You're out of here. We're getting close to leveling up, actually. It's gonna happen. And I don't have a quest here. It's just random exploration wherever the game takes us. We can always come back later. <laughs> Maybe it'll be cleared. <laughs> So, this is just kind of for exploration, experience, whatever. I heard there were a lot of hornets and bees and drove type of wing things here. So that's why we're here. Oh, another one. And then there was another bee. If we get through this, it'll be a good time to rest again. Before doing that, I found out I like to save, <laughs> and then just rest a few at a time. Save, rest, save, rest, save, rest. If there's a random encounter, we just restore. And you know I'm two points from leveling to the next level. How sweet the sound of that is. So we'll give this another rest. And I am liking this game a lot so far. It's fun. It feels very old school. It feels like kind of like fairy tale meets Ultima, <laughs> like seven or something, but way different. I'm liking this a lot. Let's do a another save, another rest. And it completely feels like its own game, so I like it. Pretty cool. I hear the second one is also fun, and the third one not so fun. I don't know. It's the first time I played any of them. I'm 6.7 hours in. <laughs> and do another save. My experience with this game is about 6.7 hours. <laughs> Except for maybe the, some of the saving and loading and restoring parts. But so far, getting close to 7 hours in, I like it a lot. I like it a lot. Do a save. And I don't know how fun it is to watch saving and restoring, but it's okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa. It's like a beehive. Har hive larvae. Is this what we need for healing potions? I had a book. No. Interesting, though. We will take more of this. If we can find it. Ooh, these bees are probably PO'd. Let's put our bless on. I don't know if I have a quest to get high in Barbie yet. I have leveled up. Is there a bee over here? Whatever, we leveled up. Let's take a look. Let's take a look. I want to increase strength, but speed is starting to is starting to help our swords play, our sword skill. I'm gonna give it two speed and one endurance. Um, I guess I could do bows. Spot hidden would be nice. I'm going to go with... I'm going to go with swords. Upgrade this skill to level 10 for one point. Awesome. And... I'm going to... I'm going to go for... I think heavy armor. So we're becoming a fighter. It's coming along. Maximum hit points. 
106. I'm still in fight mode. In the Whispering Cave. I don't know where that bee went. I guess he flew away somewhere. Faint light seeps in from above. It's just enough to allow a few twisted shrubs and trees to take root in this damp and chilly cave. You will bring us a shrubbery! That is from <laughs> a movie, not this game. There's bees. Can we face off two at a time? I think so, we just level up. We should be able to. And the blood spill is up. Maybe I should have increased deviation, I don't know. We got ya! Nice, so we're starting to level up already. Let's see here. We will save. Ooh, another... Oh, here's the missing bee. We got ya! Thanks for coming back. <laughs> I'm probably gonna run out of torches in here. Um, we seem to have been here already. Oh, there's a bee. Plus, plus where is it? 106 hit points, that's cool. So I think I'm gonna explore this area, and maybe come back and explore these other areas, I don't know. Right now, let's give it a rest. I'm excited, so playing blind, that is fun for me. You know, not blind, but playing like for a first time through, not knowing what to expect. And then having a good time doing it, that is fun, 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 fun. I mean, not playing literally blind, but I mean just playing through for the first time. Just exploring, finding new things. It's just like, it's just like taking a drive somewhere, just, you just jump in the car, you go, you just see where, you know, you just kind of see where, you know, you just kind of see where the road goes, just take a random road, be sure you have a map with you, these days there's GPS, I'm sure, and just have fun of it, this is kind of what this game feels like, just go somewhere new and have fun of it, have fun with it. Let us have in there. I did not expect to find the Whispering Caves at all. Found this place completely by accident. Oh, I don't have my bear. Jeez, I keep forgetting to do that. We will have fun with the bee. Man, he's taking away all of our hit points already. Sixty experience points for the fight, though. And our character is starting to level up pretty good. I'm liking it. Uh, restore. Restore so I can play some more. <laughs> the random encounters here are crazy. Let us do some more resting. And 106 hit points. Woo hoo! That's a Might and Magic's 9 1. Woo hoo! <laughs> okay. Might and Magic 9, whatever. That was my favorite part of a pretty much crappy game. Woo hoo! <laughs> no, there were parts of that game I thought were alright. Let's do with the patch. Before the. I remember playing that thing before the patch. Oh. There are so many bugs, quest stoppers. And I like the Might Magic series, but that thing was awful. Oh, 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 oh! The air in this chamber is heavy and sour. The floor is covered in soft, moist dung, crawling with beetles. Yuck! In the darkness above you, you hear a cacophony of, sh of shrill screeches. Bats. 
It'd be best not to disturb anything here. I might disturb it anyways. Just because. We might have a lot of bat fights. Something here. You know there's going to be a random encounter. Well, I don't know. I'm just guessing. A wizard's hat. Somebody has been here before. Let's go in the center. You see two large rocks with something wedged in between. <laughs> okay, well, uh, evil amulets. It's plus one damage. Lots of bats. I don't have my bless up. We can take these guys out there, right? Uh, 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 Is my bless down again? There we go. Lots of rounds in this combat. <laughs> I think we can do this. I think we can do this. I think we can do this. Some cool experience too. I don't know if I want to wear the evil amulet or not. That was good experience though. We'll go this way. Nice! We got some kind of an amulet out there. will give us some rest a little bit of the time cool I did not expect that but very 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 fun I want to see what's what more there is to explore I see if we kind of go south west and north you know around that round circle we will look like there's another passageway to explore <laughs> this is pre-Diablo. Just kidding. <laughs> it's not. So, let's see here. This plays like its own game. I like it. It's too bad I guess there aren't more games like these, but... Maybe not a lot of people play them. I don't know. I think there's a fair amount of people that played this. It might not have been the best seller, but... You have to see this... I guess back at when this game was made, you, you have to see the game in the store, guys, before can play it or hear about it. I guess it's online now, so that's good too. Uh, we will save. We will light a torch. We will venture forth. So glad I was able to find this game. I heard about it, just didn't know much about it. And then I saw ah! Mr. Alana Ray play. I'm going, oh wow, gotta play this game. And I'd heard about ah! it. It was like on my watch list of things to maybe buy, try, play. Ah! Oh, that drone got us good, huh? We will rest some more then. And a shout out to my buddy Dara out there. This is sort of how I play games. <laughs> I usually don't talk during them, unless I'm trying to record for fun. And that's sort of how I do like uh, saves. Sometimes I call them exploring, searching, fighting, name of the place, beginning date, that kind of thing. I guess I began on 824. And um, just been playing a little bit here and there. And that's sort of how I play the games or whatever. So let's give another rest. Just like to have fun. And I kind of play variety of games. Sometimes I'll play a game for a long time, other times. You know, I won't. 
a lot of times I like to go online, play those types of games. I don't know if M MMOs are dying or what, but I like playing Lord of the Rings online lately. It's a free account for me. Ah, I just get it. That's some nice people on that game. That's good. Man, my hit points already bad. Okay. We'll get through this though. We will rest up on our hit points. I'm determined to explore this place as much as, as much of it as I can. I think we've explored a lot of it so far though. I like to loop back and explore a couple areas sort of in the entrance to the cave. The whispering, the whistling cave. They call it whisper, whispering caves. Oops. There, I got my bless up. What is this way? I don't know. We're gonna try and find out. That we are gonna try and find out, definitely. Seems like I have to rest like after every fight. <laughs> it's okay though. At 60 experience points apiece, that's okay. And they aren't particularly hard to fight, unless you get like a whole bunch of them fighting at the same time. And we will rest it up, and there we go. Poor John. Plus two up. A big cave. I didn't think the cave would be this big. <laughs> Not at all. TNT. Yeah, yeah. Should I do it? No, I don't want to do it. <laughs> Here comes Mr. Drone. Ah! I'm just gonna roll with a lot of resting in here. <laughs> and restoring. Gosh darn. So I've been playing this game seven hours. So weed! Since what, 824 to what is it today? It's Labor Day, September 1st? I played a total of seven hours. <laughs> I really do like this game though. I really do. I might jump on Titan Quest later. I'm not sure. We'll see. We shall see. Save, save, save. feeling this might connect. And it might not. <laughs> I guess it doesn't connect. Oh, here's some kind of rock. An unknown gem or something. There we go. Finding the unknown. Searching and looking for the unknown. There's an excitement to that. Hey, this this time I was blessed with a spell. Get you down. Another one. Another one. <laughs> okay. Fight me one time is better than all three at once. I understand this. More, huh?
gets the dangerous pass. No? Room combat music. Oh, here he comes, here he comes. Let's back up just in case. Nice! Can we rest? We can rest finally. Let's do a save. So a little bit less than 3,000 experience to go to next level. That is good. Awesome, this is fun. I, I'm liking it, so <laughs> that's how it rolls here. I like it. I like that I play it, you know? <laughs> it's fun. Let's see here. Save, save, rest. I don't know if the resting is getting annoying to watch or whatever, but sorry about that if it is. But I am having fun of this. The key to life is. Well, there's lots of keys to life, and don't listen to me for my two cents for nothing, but. If you can enjoy things in life, that's, that's a good key to life. <laughs> if you can find a way to enjoy things. Find a good hobby. We all like different types of things, it's fine. Find a good hobby. Try not- oh... Try not to let have, have somebody in life that looks like this try to ruin your enjoyment for you. Oh... I don't know if we can beat that. Fight off your ad. You're paralyzed. Oh, that's... Ooh, this is not good. <laughs> not good. I am not strong enough. This part at all. <laughs> not good. If I could just pull one somehow, good luck. Here comes the big one. This is going to be a test fight because I have no idea if I can beat it. Um, the great, actually, at least get a little bit more protection. It's going to be hard to see, but we're going to call this the great bee fight. The great bee fight. I hope it's just this one big bee, then a whole bunch of other ones. Here she comes. Could be a he or a she, I don't know. Oh boy, here we go. Oh, don't move. Not on the turn base combat game. Oh boy, paralyzed. Getting owned. Getting owned. Oh, this fight's gonna suck. The great bee fight that <laughs> isn't gonna happen. Okay. Oh my gosh, it got hard. If I didn't get paralyzed and I could hit more. My character does not like to hit. Oh, don't move. Jeez, you wasted a turn by doing that. Don't move. Wasted a whole turn. Oh, why, why do I keep moving? Dum dum. Uh, my character likes to move instead of fight. I don't know why. Okay, well. Shoot, we're not strong enough for this B fight.
Not unless I were to able to drag her back and forth in between screens. Let's try. You just hit more off. Oh, if you could just hit her some more. No paralyzing. Oh. No paralyzing. <laughs> I could get you. Ah, oh, come on. Oh, paralyzed. I can't even see where I'm going. If I can get away and rest. Get away and rest. Hey, that might be a way to do it. I'm not sure if the queen bee or whatever the bee is will gain the hit points back, but this could be one way to vote to win. I'm certainly gonna. It's a good strategy. It's a good try. If she didn't paralyze me, I could maybe win that fight. If I gave it a, several tries. Paralyzing though, terrible, terrible, terrible. We'll see if it's still weakened or we gotta go at it again. All oh, these random encounters. Restore the great bee fight. I wanna at least try this, so. See if we can get to 60 without an encounter. Aha! Save. Save the Great Bee Fight. Great Bee Fight hype! Coming up. We'll go to 75. this all the way up to our max hit points and we're gonna try this again Shield off for now. Oh, she's still damaged. We can do this. The less is up. Sweet! That's how you do it. Run away and then come back later to fight another day. Literally another day. It took many days to rest. Many hours. Sweet! We can do this. How would you stop moving around when you're fighting? It's like a whole turn. And we beat him. Something has been dropped. Used up a torch. Okay, we have a hive queen stinger. Category category short blade weapons. Poison. We'll take it. We will take that. That was fun. We well, we found a way through the fight. We survived the great queen bee fight. We survived the Great Queen Bee fight of Labor Day 2014, yeah! <laughs> that was cool. <laughs> First time doing that, so that was fun. Fun upon top of more fun. It can be done.
I don't know if that's a quest item or anything. I don't think it is. Put on a short blade weapon, I guess. Do some more resting. we'll get out of this cave here pretty soon. Okay. Our hit points are back up. Use another torch. There was another bee in here, but we should be able to take it on. I don't know if there's anything in this room or not, but we're about to find out. Larvae. Five larvae will take it. They're hard to get. Oh, skull. Well, we can sell it. It's only worth ten. Maybe they're good for alchemy. I don't know. We got a bunch of hive larvae. I'm glad they don't stack. But awesome! I'll probably end up selling them, I don't know. Trade them for more fortunes. <laughs> okay, cool! Go back to some of the other areas. I'm assuming that was the hardest area inside these caves was that queen bee. We will end the queen the bee infestation by getting rid of the queen and getting rid of all the other bees, and that helps for that hive not to infest anything else. Unless they found a new queen bee, I don't know, I have no idea. Okay, there's another area to explore down here. I would like to check it out. Good time as any to save. Oh, it might connect up to where we've already been. Okay, we've explored this area already. Apparently. Okay, we're gonna go back to the beginning. I think we pretty much cleared this place, but I'm gonna go back to the beginning of the cave, which is somewhere over here. There's some other areas to explore down here. I'm gonna turn off the torch while we go there. Conserve a little bit of torch light. Torch time or whatever. I don't know why, but I really like this whispering cave. Let us go this way. A total optional area, but who cares? Fun, 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 fun. It's taking a little bit of a while to walk through here, but that's okay. I went through some underground water. <laughs> My character was thirsty. It's like, no, it couldn't really. We need some light or whatever. So, probably equip the torch here again pretty soon. I'd like to see what's this way. Oh, there's another fight. I saw something red light up. He's in there. I don't know if we can get to him, but he's there. 
Ooh, and lots of levers. You know what's a cat eye look like? Um. Instead of wasting our torches. I guess the higher the deviation skill, the more the better this cat eye will work. I'm gonna run out of torches though, too, in that for too long. Let's try. There's a bunch of levers here. Okay, probably another puzzle I have I have no idea what to do. What's this? A strange set of levers so deep in the remote cave. Perhaps they operate the old mining equipment that was long ago abandoned. Or maybe when manipulated correctly, they open a secret door to a thieves' lair. There's only one way to find out. <laughs> yeah, I don't know the order. I guess I could try to look for a hint. I'm sure it's going to be this easy. No, it won't be this easy. Papers. I have no idea if it mentions it. I guess there's a question here to kill the Hive Queen. We apparently did that. Um, let's take a look here. Too bad the recorder doesn't have a pause button. mostly blind, but I have some hints. It's really rough. Uh, I guess, well, there is a quest where I had to kill the the Hive Queen, which I just did. It says something about finding Lilith, so we'll try to do that. And there's nothing about these levers, so I'm gonna I'm gonna avoid that for now. Okay, well cool. Let's get out of this place. We are done here. Actually there's one other maybe small area. I guess that's one cool thing about this game, if you go into an area, I'm probably gonna keep the hive stinger. If you go into an area, it's like, you know, I guess <laughs> we already did, we, we did a future quest already. <laughs> that's cool. I like that. So it's proof it's not necessarily a non-linear game. There is something sticking out in the cracks in a nearby rock. A small emerald, we'll take it. Thank you, I wouldn't have noticed that, thank you. Should I save? Might be a good idea. It looks as if this area has been blasted shut. You can hear air whistling through the tunnels on the other side of the rock pile. It looks as if, as if this was an attempt to seal the deeper sections of the cave off to prevent anything from getting in or out. I just let let's 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 see if I haven't done this yet. How can I activate that cake? Oh. 
Oh well. Okay, we're out of here. I'm done with this place. It was fun. We did the quest without... I didn't even know I was on a quest. I had a feeling the High Queen would be a quest from somewhere. Anyways, we are out of here. That was fun. I liked it a lot. Let's get some daylight, please. Let's go back to the game world. It's nighttime here, but that's okay. I could do some resting anyways. Nice, give it a save. We are we are back to the surface. So from here, let's take a look at our map. I guess we're gonna go let's just explore more of the place. That's how it goes. <laughs>